All right, here we go, BFit Nation. Looks like we are live. Welcome, BFit Nation, to another wonderful week. Here's a great way to start off our Mondays. Today, we have a cardio and resistance-based workout for you today. I'm joined with Senior, uh, senior Mass Sergeant Sonia Berry. How are you, ma'am? Hi, good. I'm doing well this morning. I can't believe the weather is still so warm here in Dallas. And I know. I'm ready for a good workout this morning to start off the week. Absolutely. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. We are... Um, we have some wonderful weather for us today. I am outdoors. Uh, Sergeant Barry is indoors. And again, if you're new to BFIT Live, welcome. We come to you every Monday with a at-home um, cardio and resistance-based workout for just under 30 minutes of work. Uh, Sergeant Barry and I will guide you through each exercises as we go uh, to complete, again, a full total body workout uh, from at home, from outdoors, from indoors, wherever you may be, and we don't we don't take up much room here. So uh, that's the great um, alternative that we have here uh, on BFit Live. So once again, welcome. Settle in. Uh, I will go through some of the exercises that we have for today. That way, there are no surprises. We know exactly what we're getting into while once we hit these workouts, and then uh, we'll dive right in. So. Today's workout, again, cardio and strength-based uh, workouts. Our exercise number one is going to be a squat jump here. So this is designed to get your heart rate elevated as well as work on your lower body extremities. So I'll go through the four exercises here and then we'll go into some dynamic stretching here. So exercise number one, squat jumps. We're gonna, we are going to drop our hips down. Our feet are gonna be shoulder width apart here. Let me scoot back here. And this is gonna be home for us. And we want to work on exploding off of those heels and toes, utilizing our hands to drive ourselves up with a jump out of that squat that we are going to be into. Okay, second exercise, alternating bicep curl to overhead press. <clears throat> if you have any resistance available to you at home, if you have dumbbells, if you have anything with a handle, let's go ahead and grab that and uh, challenge yourselves for this workout here. Now, the bicep curl to overhead press, we can stand, we can sit, we can use a chair to isolate ourselves on if we need to, again. But we are going to bicep curl uh, into an overhead press. So it'll look like this. Our, our elbows are gonna be tucked in to our sides here, rotate out palms facing outward now and pressing overhead here. Back down to start position. Again, bicep curl up with the left arm, extending over our heads, back down nice and controlled, nice and smooth, and at your own pace here. Uh, pick a weight that's comfortable, yet challenging for you. That way you can work on your um, work for 30 seconds, uh, 40 seconds of work here. And if I didn't, <clears throat> excuse me, if I didn't mention this, our programming for today is gonna to be 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four exercises at four rounds of work in total and one minute rest in between each round. Again, that's 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four exercises and one minute rest in between each round. So exercise three is gonna be a dumbbell Romanian deadlift with a row. So it's gonna be a combo here. If you have, again, if you have resistance, Go ahead and grab that. We are gonna be targeting our lower body once again with this movement, specifically our hamstrings and our glutes. We are gonna take some weight here, lower down nice and controlled. And once we get down to that bottom portion, we are gonna add in a row to incorporate our back, nice and controlled, nice and smooth, and extending up through those hips. Again, nice and slow, drop that. Uh, hinging at the hips here, keeping your back nice and flat adding in a row and then back up top through those hips. Okay, and exercise four, we're gonna take it to the floor here. Let me take you down here. We have two push-ups and 10 mountain climbers, okay? So two push-ups first and then go into your mountain climber sequence and then two push-ups and then 10 mountain climbers. Two push-ups, 10 mountain climbers for the 40 seconds of work. 
So again, hands are gonna be underneath our shoulders here, feet just under shoulder width apart. We will drop down into our two push-ups. High plank here, drive those knees to the chest here for 10 mountain climbers. That's five each leg and then two push-ups and then 10 mountain climbers in total. Okay, so that's gonna be the four exercises for today. Again, if you're just joining us, welcome to BeFit Live. We have 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four exercises, four rounds with one minute rest in between each round. That's the program for today. Let's go ahead and get, grab some water, grab a towel, and we will jump into some dynamic stretching. I hope everyone had a great weekend and is having a great start to your day. Let us know where you're watching from. Drop a comment. If you have any questions, let us know. It's nice to see where everyone's watching from, where everyone is working out from across the world. So again, welcome to Be Fit Live. Just like every workout, we start off with some dynamic stretching here. It's time to get dynamic. It's time to warm up our bodies, to warm up our minds, to get our bodies flowing in the right mindset to accomplish this workout. So let's start off with some dynamic quad stretching. We're gonna reach with that right leg back and that left arm is gonna go all the way up, nice and tall, nice and proud. Let's go at your own pace here, alternate left leg back, right arm up, really pushing those hips forward. You can feel that stretch in the front here, in the front of your hips hip flexors, extending all the way up with that right and left arm just a little bit further each time. Good, good, good. Again, dynamic stretching. We're gonna aim to stretch out multiple muscle groups at once here. Let's go to the top of the mat here from so, for some reverse lunge reaches here. Again, my right leg is gonna extend all the way back, dropping that knee down, hands coming together and reaching over to the side. Again, opening up our hips, getting some blood flow to our lower body. Nice, at your own pace here. We're gonna go through about 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds of stretching here for each movement. Again, this is a great time to feel out if you are tight in any, any areas, scan that body. One more for me. Ah, feel that stretch in the lats. Good job, good job. Let's go into some fixed feet lateral lunges here. Nice wide stance. Feet are gonna be facing straight forward here and we are going to lunge side to side here. Nothing too aggressive. We wanna keep that chest up and feel that stretch within our inner thighs. You can also feel blood flow moving to your lower extremities your glutes, your hamstrings. Again, inner thigh here. Good, good, good. All right, just a few more here. Okay, let's go into some body squats here. Take your time here. Since we have some squat activity coming up on our first exercise. Let's warm up with the motion. A couple of keys here is to make sure that your knees are tracking just over your toes. Dropping those hips, hips back and down to your comfort level, keeping that back nice and flat. A few more here. Speed it up. Okay. All right, let's go into some arm circles here. We do have some shoulder work to take care of. Slow down the tempo here. Nice medium sized arm circles, warming up those shoulders, warming up the rotator cuff for the overhead presses and let's reverse. We need to go wider if you feel comfortable. You can go wider as well, feel out where you may be tight. Again, a great time to fill out 
how your body's responding this morning. Okay, good work, good work. Hinge reaches here for our a shoulder width stance here, soft bend at the knees, hinging at the hips, arms nice and tall here, reaching for the sky, bending over 70, about 45 degrees here, and back up top, pushing those hips forward. So we are trying to warm up those hamstrings, that lower back, feel the stretch in our shoulders, keeping that head nice and neutral. It's following you along your downward path and upward path. Squeezing your glutes together at the top, pushing those hips forward. Good, good, good. Three more here. Two, one, awesome work. All right, I'm feeling loose. I'm feeling warm. Let's grab some water, let's towel off and let's get ready to get to work here. <laughs> All right, BFED Nation, are you ready to go? Let me start my timer over here. Again, we have 40 seconds of work 20 seconds of rest, four rounds of work at our four exercises, and one minute rest in between each round. Okay, squat jumps are up first. Squat jumps in 10. Lower this. Five more seconds, four, three, two, one. 40 seconds of work here. Feet are shoulder width apart here. Knees are tracking over our toes, and we are working on power, a little bit of power, a little bit of explosiveness through those feet, drive up those arms, and drive them back to get a little bit more minimum here. Take your time here, 20 more seconds of work here. Again, this will catch up to you as far as cardio base goes. You'll really feel the burn in your quads in your glutes with the explosive power. Six more seconds of work here. Three, two, one, and rest. 20 seconds of rest here, and then we will go into our alternating bicep curl to overhead press. I'm gonna come from a kneeling stance here. You can stand, or if you have a chair available, go ahead and sit down for this one as well. Again, two, one, Bicep curl here, up, right arm goes up into our overhead press. Nice and controlled, nice and smooth, alternate. Let's make sure that our elbows are tucked in close to our body here, minimizing the sway and press overhead here. Again, palms are gonna be starting off towards your body, curling up towards you as well and then rotate away from you and palms facing outward. Three more seconds here, two, one. All right, good work here. Keeping with resistance, we're gonna stand here for those Romanian deadlifts with a row. Again, we're here, hinging at the hips for eight more seconds of rest here. Five, four, three, two, one, all right, feet are shoulder width apart. We are hinging at the hips soft, bend at the knees. Again, activating our lower body, nice and controlled, nice and smooth, no rush here. We are chasing the clock here. <clears throat> good work, good work. Again, let's make sure that back is flat. Eight more seconds here. <clears throat> Head is looking in a neutral position. Three, two, one. Awesome work. Awesome work. All right, team. 15 seconds of rest and we are going down to the floor for our combo, two push-ups and 10 mountain climbers. Two push-ups and 10 mountain climbers coming up in four, three, Two, one. All right, team, here we go. Hands are just underneath our shoulders here for the most support. 
we are knocking out two push-ups and 10 mountain climbers. All right, after you complete 10 mountain climbers, go back into those two push-ups, nice and controlled, nice and smooth. Again, this combo is gonna get our heart rate up, working on our core stability, keeping those abs tight, driving those knees to our chest. Five more seconds of work here. Three, two, one, and time. Good job, good job. All right, that one got my heart rate elevated. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. So first round done, first round complete. We have 40 seconds of rest here and then we will jump directly into our squat jumps. Now's a good time to reassess how you're feeling. If you are able to scale up and uh, make things more challenging, make these exercises more challenging, they are as challenging as you make them. So if you grab heavier weights, of course, it's gonna be challenging. If we need to scale back any of these exercises, I can go ahead and show you those at this next set here. 15 seconds of work, uh, 15 seconds of rest, rather. Grab water, <laughs> grab towel. All right, eight more seconds and we will go into squat jumps here. First set, we learned it. All right, second round, let's own it here. All right, here we go. Squat jumps for 40 seconds. Now, if you feel that the jump is just too much for you, go ahead and scale it down just to a squat here. Okay? And more so, if that's too much, just go ahead and drop down and hold this lower squat position here. Okay, for 14 more seconds. 10, nine, good work, good work, Sergeant Barry. Three, two, one, time. 20 seconds of rest here. And I was gonna say, if you need some assistance as well, go ahead and grab onto a chair, a table, anything that you may be close to that you may uh, be able to benefit from support and hold on to that as you squat jump here. Alternating bicep curls coming up in three, two, one. All right, here we go. We're curling and we're pushing here. Again, keeping those elbows tucked into your side. Nice and controlled, nice and strong movement here. Let's focus on a slow pace here. 40 seconds of work. We'll creep up on you here. 18 more seconds left. If you don't have any resistance available, go ahead and make that fist squeeze accentuate that long push overhead. Five more seconds of work here. Three, two, one, good work. All right, all right team, back up top for those Romanian deadlifts with the added row. <clears throat> Eight more seconds here. Four, three, stand up tall, nice and proud. All right, let's work hinging at those hips, dropping down, squeezing those shoulder blades together. Nice and control, nice and smooth. And bringing those hips forward. Again, we're incorporating our hamstrings here with this lower stretch here. And then including that, incorporating that row will give us the ability to work on our back as well. Two for one here, a lot of bang for our buck. 10 more seconds left. Five more seconds. Nice and controlled, nice and smooth. Two, one. All right, good job, good job. All right. Coming down to our last exercise for our second round here. Two push ups, 10 mountain climbers on deck here in two, one. Down for two push ups and 10 mountain climbers. All right, if you need more stability, go ahead and drop those feet out a little bit wider during that push up, and that will help with stability. One, two. All right, how are we doing? 15 more seconds. 
Good, good, good. Keep pushing. I know it burns. Seven more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Awesome. Awesome job. Woo. <laughs> All right, those will get your heart rate elevated. <clears throat> and so what's nice about combining two different movements is that you're able to get a little bit more bang for your buck here on such a short workout. We can incorporate more muscle groups than maybe just the, the uh, deadlift or maybe just the row. So we get upper body and lower body bicep curl to overhead reach, again, bicep and to shoulder action. So two for one there. All right. 15 more seconds and we will go directly into those squat jumps for round three. Okay, body weight only here. Four more seconds. Three, two. All right, team, let's work. All right, round three. Let's go ahead and work on some explosiveness here. Go ahead and really try and get some air to your comfort. Nice and controlled, nice and smooth. Work on driving through those heels, working on that power, incorporating those fast switch muscle fibers here. A little different than just squatting alone. Five more seconds. Keep pushing, two, one. Awesome work, awesome work. <laughs> I think we've burnt enough calories with that one exercise alone. <laughs> All right, five seconds here and we will go into our alternating bicep curl to overhead press. All right, here we go. 40 seconds of work coming up. This is our third round. We should be warm. We should be feeling good. If it gets tough, remember to smile. <laughs> Smiling makes the weight lighter. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's scientifically proven. <laughs> but mentally, it helps me. Eight more seconds left here. Keep pushing through. Five. Four, good, two, one, last rep, time. 20 seconds of rest here. Hold on to that resistance. Romanian deadlifts with the row in 10. Again, if you're scaling up, let's go ahead and challenge ourselves. Two, one, if you are, let's work here, 40 seconds. Again, if you don't have any resistance available, let's go ahead and make that strong, tight fist. And let's work on our movements here. Work on our form. Okay, go ahead and hinge at the hips here, drawing those shoulder blades back. Elbows should be moving towards the sky here. Back down, back's nice and flat. Head is looking just a few feet above me here. Seven more seconds. Keep pushing. Three, two, one, and time. Good work, team. Good work, team. 15 more seconds of rest here. BFIT Nation, where are you watching from? Let us know. Where are we tuning in from? Push ups and mountain climbers coming up in two, one. We're on the ground, we're on deck. And we're pushing. And we're climbing. Five, 10 mountain climbers and two push ups here. Again, let's go at your own pace here. Driving those knees to your chest. Nice strong push up. Again, keeping those shoulder, those elbows close to your body. 10 more seconds. Now, we need to, two, one, and time. Good job, good job, good job, okay. I was gonna mention, 
if we need to go ahead and scale down that two push up to 10 mountain climbers, let's go and add two push ups here. And then just hold out a high plank instead of the mountain climbers. Or you can eliminate the push up and just hold that high plank. Go ahead and work on toe tapping until you get comfortable to really extend those knee drives <laughs> for that last exercise there. Great alternatives there. 20 seconds of rest. And we are moving into our last and final round of work here. I know time flies when you're having fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, five more seconds here. Jump squats in three, two, one. All right, team, let's go. Nice, nice. Try and land softly here. Absorb your weight. Explode up through those heels. Good. Nice, 20 seconds here. Nice and high, how high can we go? Really get some air, 10 more seconds. Get some air here. Keep pushing. There we are. Be fit nation in three, two, one. All right. Good job, good job, good work. Good work. Grab that resistance that you have. Let's go ahead in eight seconds here. I said to overhead press. In three, two, one, we're working. I know it's Monday. We're getting a bicep pump in, a shoulder pump. <laughs> getting ready for the week, nice and strong. 20 more seconds left here. Again, let's work nice and controlled. Working on that form, keeping that core tight and engaged, protecting that lower back here. Eight more seconds. Good, good, good. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. All right. And we're sticking with that weight. 10 more seconds of rest. <laughs> Woo! I'm feeling this one. Yeah. Here we go. In three, two. I know. <laughs> Here we go. Romanian deadlifts with that added row. Okay, you should feel that nice stretch in your hamstrings as you lower, nice and controlled driving those weights up to the lower chest here, squeezing those shoulder blades together. Good, good, good. Back nice and flat. 10 more seconds here, heads in the neutral position, not up, not down, but in neutral. Three, two, one, and time. Good job, good job. All right, set those weights down. Last set, best set here. We're down on the ground. We're down on deck here. Again, scale it back, modify if you need to. In three, two, one. All right, let's go. Two push ups, 10 mountain climbers. That's one each leg. One, two, three, four, five, and. Here we go. Let's make sure those hands are under your shoulders for the best support here. Halfway there, less than that. Keep pushing, last 10. Here we go, there we go. Five, four, three, two, last push up. <laughs> and time. <laughs> Be fit nation, good job. Good job, team. Good job, team. Come down here. How are we doing? How are we feeling? All right. Be fit nation, let us know. How did you do? 
what was the uh what was your most favorite exercise that we went through today i know I'm catching my breath here <laughs> this is a this is a nice cardio and resistance based workout we had a lot of each here a good amount to elevate our heart rate burn those additional calories and a good resistance based pieces to these workouts to work on our strength development again each week we progress to be the stronger and better versions of ourselves here so sergeant barry how are you doing ma'am i'm good i'm glad you waited to call up me till i caught my breath again but honestly today's was like one of my favorites it was good felt really good I really like the Roman deadlift with the row. That's like awesome. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, ma'am. This, this, this was programmed to be a 50-50 of, of cardio-based and resistance-based. So not only were we just, ele again, elevating our heart rate to, to work on you know, our cardiovascular system, work on and focusing on, on higher intensity, but also working on strength development working on those muscle groups that we use on a daily basis. I always say every day is a workout. It may not be a resistance-based workout, but we do a lot of these functional movements on a daily basis, and we may not even think about it. But incorporating um, movements like we do here, it's, it's just become second nature, muscle memory, if you will, and it'll transverse into our daily lives and our daily routine. So again, this is a great time uh, be fit live to focus on yourself to develop yourself and get better and stronger strength wise uh, mindset wise cardiovascular system wise um, every week each and every week here and so all of our be fit lives are housed on our facebook page if you drop down onto our uh, categories within our facebook page you can go into uh, i would say maybe 20 plus workouts here each one are different, but they're able to guide you through a full week, two week, three week, four week program. If you're looking for additional uh, workouts, if you need a spark, if you need anything new that you'd like to add to your existing workout program, find them here on our BFIT Lives. Um, so <laughs> again, um, while I catch my breath, any last words, Sergeant Barry from you? Just thank you to our viewers. And see you next Monday. Yes, ma'am. Absolutely. Great time here. Uh, on behalf of Sergeant Barry and myself, stay ready, stay resilient, and let's stay fit, guys. Be fit live. Signing out.